The only thing better than the food at Amore is Chef Jenna. So we always say that you guys, our viewers, are our favorite producers, our partners in content. And we're starting a new series today called Best Restaurants. The best restaurants, literally according to you. And so many of my friends of large and small businesses in the restaurant industry have had to pivot, um, like so many families, have struggled, many have lost their businesses, and we're really trying to feature and support the best of the best of our local favorites wherever you may live. So we are gonna kick off the series today to celebrate um, smaller businesses, sort of like what you would call a mom and pop. Um, with our best restaurants, we kick it off today from Grand Rapids, Michigan. It's an authentic Italian uh, family restaurant, uh, and it was recommended by the Reynolds family. Uh, so this is brought to you by the Reynolds family, and we are introducing you to Amore Frateria. I'm Carrie, And I'm Gordon. We're the Reynolds family from Lowell, Michigan. Our favorite restaurant is Amore Trattoria, and it is about 45 minutes from our house, but totally worth the drive. We love the fact that the food is authentic Italian food. It is not what you can get at, you know, a typical chain restaurant. My favorite food at Amore Trattoria is the lasagna for sure. The lasagna is just delicious. My favorite food at Amore Charina is the lobster ravioli. She gets that just about every single time it's on the menu. Arancini. Oh, arancini. the arancini. Fried risotto balls with cheese inside. Oh, oh perfect. so good. You know, the only thing better than the food at Amore is Chef Jenna. I'm Jenna Archidiacono, and I am the chef and co-owner of Amore Trattoria Italiana with my husband. I met Maurizio when I moved off to San Francisco, and he's from Italy, and he took me on a whirlwind trip. We went to we meet his mother, and she taught me everything I know about Italian food one-on-one, -on -one, and she continues to teach me every time I visit. She is as authentic as her food. She has the kindest, most giving heart. And, you know, we've been going there for 11 years. When we opened our doors, we had a lot of people that were upset that we didn't have garlic bread and spaghetti and meatballs. But we wanted to stick to our guns. And so we would say, hey, why don't you try this instead? This is our lasagna alla bolognese, fresh pasta. When someone comes to a restaurant like ours and asks for fettuccine Alfredo, it's like nails on a chalkboard because like Rachel says, that's something that was invented in, you know, America. Jenna is a big hugger. She will hug several of her customers within an evening. As soon as COVID hit and we couldn't hug one another anymore, Jenna did one of the things we love so much about her. She problem solved and she decided that she was gonna hug people through her food. And so Food Hugs was born. Food Hugs started with us giving food to families in need Maybe their family was struggling with COVID. And then that rolled into us, starting to feed the local hospitals. They were working overtime, the EMTs, the fire departments, the police departments. And it just kind of snowballed from there. And we just kept feeding as many possible people as we could with some food hugs, just to bring their days a little bit of a smile after uh, you know a tough, tough season. She treats her customers like family. We love everything that there is about Amore and what Chef Jenna and Amore stand for. And the food is the best food that we can get outside of Italy. All of this is making me so hungry. I think we should go to Amore for dinner tonight. All right, kids, get in the car. We're going to Amore. Yeah!